from California seek recognition. I ask unanimous consent to address the House for one minute. Without objection. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Recently, the Supreme Court took unprecedented, deeply disappointing, and an ideologically driven action to overturn Roe v. Wade. This is a targeted attack on Americans' rights to make decisions for their bodies, their lives, and their future. This decision sets a very dangerous precedent for our nation's highest court and is the result of a premeditated agenda from radical conservatives to dismantle access to comprehensive reproductive care. The decision to have an abortion is a deeply personal one, one that should be made between a patient and their doctor, not by politically motivated judges or politicians. Roe offered Americans protections from the unsolicited belief systems and ideologies of others being imposed on them and their personal health care decisions. I am committed to continuing to work alongside House Democrats and President Biden in the fight for reproductive freedom and reproductive justice and the right to abortion across the United States. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and I yield back. For what purpose does the gentleman from Wisconsin